All right, so here we are in the uh, trunk of the Cobra on the driver's side. I just wanted to go over the fuel pump driver module and the uh, Kenny Bell Booster pump that I have set up. And so here's the FPDM or the fuel pump driver module, black box. And um, it's a modified one. The only thing I had to do was unplug it and plug in the new one. But uh, that's another story. Here is the uh, Booster pump, this red box. And as you can see, what I did to mount it uh, is I went to the hardware store and just got a uh, nut and a bolt. I got two of those and just fed them through the existing bracket. So I've mounted this uh, booster pump to be floating in the air. And that will help with some cooling. And uh, also, I think it's a good spot for it so it's not bouncing around as much as if it's attached to the car. And it has this rubber insulation. And uh, just ran that around there as well. So I wanted to go over the wiring. There's uh, a red wire, a violet wire, and then there's three black wires. I wanted to show you where each of those go. So we'll start with uh, the violet colored wire coming out of the top there. So as you see, it uh, leaves the booster pump and comes around and it goes into where the fuel pump driver module plug is. That's this connector right here. So what you want to do is uh, take this green wire with a yellow stripe and uh, give it a, a little bit of space coming off of the harness and then cut it. So that's going to leave you with two ends. So the first end will of that green wire with a yellow stripe will plug into the violet colored wire. Then the red wire that's coming out of here that has the inline fuse will come down and plug into the other end of that green wire with the yellow stripe. So you're only cutting one wire. It's that green one with the yellow stripe. Okay, so then the next one, uh, there's this black ground that's coming out of here. And it just goes over and it's grounded right back uh, in with where the regular FPDM is grounded. So that's pretty easy. Then you have two uh, remote wires. So uh, one of those, that's uh, this one here, this one's gonna come down and uh, it, they give you plenty of wire so I just have it kind of rolled up. But it eventually will go into this Kenny Bell booster pump uh, switch. And so we have that turned up to 100%. Okay, the last wire that's coming out of here is uh, one last black one, and it's for the hob switch. And so uh, basically what that means is if you have the car set up so that the booster pump only comes on when the car's making boost, and it senses that uh, through that hob switch, then um, you need to have that hooked up. But in this case, we're getting our reading off of the fuel pump driver module. So all you have to do with this last black wire is uh, strip it and there's two wires inside and you just connect the two of them together. And so they go to nowhere.